Every single thing is feeling right I don't really think that we should fight this Are you Alright, what up guys? It's your boy Dead Flamingo here. And today I'm gonna show you how to max out your character in Skyrim. So as all of you I'm sure know, you got your level thing here. So you already got a level up. Just do stamina. You got your level stuff here. And there's a lot of other skills that Skyrim doesn't tell you about. So they don't appear on this little list. But what they do is instantly bring up your level. So if you're level like 10, you'd instantly go to level 11. Uh, so today I'm going to show you a few of those. Alright, so this first secret skill is known as the talk to a guard. It has to be a Stormcloak soldier. But talk to a Stormcloak soldier, a guard, or whatever, then jump off of the lookout tower. So this is what you're going to do. You just talk to them. See those warriors from Hammerfell? They've got curved swords curved swords all right right after he finishes you just jump off bang and you see that skill in on to the next one all right so this next one what you're going to do is find a dragon like so and what you're going to do is just basically attack the dragon and what you're going to get is the uh save the town from the dragon skill up so i mean you're going to need to kill it of course what i do is just run up to the dragon attack it of course they're gonna fly away because that's what dragons do you just try sometimes if they kill uh whoever they're attacking it will not give you the skill increase so there we go we go killed the blood dragon that was shooting fire i mean uh, ice makes a lot of sense now just wait for you to absorb the soul and then it will give you the skill increase you ready here we go Getting the dragon soul. See how she's right there? She's seeing that we saved the dragon. You're someone who can get things done. Alright, see dragon soul absorb. And then there we go, right after we got it. Save the town. Perk. Increased. Alright, so this next skill is known as put some lotion on some ash spawns. So it's real easy to do it. All you do is you run up to them. He just boom lotion eyes. All right, guys. So this next skill increase is known as the kill a chicken with magic. Ring. So you can you're gonna want to use summon arrow, and you're just gonna hit a chicken with it. And all right, there we go. Now you can do this one as many times as you want, just as long as you don't run out of chickens. So do it. Do it again. And you'll notice it goes up. And one last time. Alright. So yeah, that's all the chickens I can find for now. So you're just... The only limit with this one is the amount of chickens you can find. But they do usually spawn... Alright, well he's not happy about it. But they do usually spawn in other areas. It does not work on any other wildlife. As you'll see, we can kill this elk but yeah see it increased conjuration but it will not increase the kill a chicken spell because it was not a chicken all right this one you're gonna need to find a river or a creek as so and then you're gonna get in the water and what you're gonna want to do is splishy splash around and you do that uh, a few seconds and then you'll notice uh there we go see splishy splash increase See that? Notice how we instantly go up a level. Alright, so this next secret skill is I'm sure one that a lot of you have gotten before. I'm just going to show it for the newcomers. This is called the Solitude in Solitude. So all you're going to want to do is go into a room in Solitude. Now since it's nighttime, we might have to sneak around. Alright, so once you find a place that you can get into, you just go up to the door. If it's daytime, you can go in by yourself. I'm just doing it at night. But basically, you just break into the place real quick. Second. Alright, there we go. And then you're going to go in. Remember, it's called Solitude and Solitude. So what do you think you got to do? You got to be solitudial. So you just walk into a place that you are that you are completely alone and take a seat 
and then you'll notice right when I sit down boom skill increase alright so this next one's known as the throat of death skill so all you gotta do is transport up to here to the third of the world and then you're just gonna run over right back here and then just jump off and make sure that you die doesn't have to be on the first jump yeah there we go see how we're dead now so alright and skilling there we go alright for this next one all you gotta do is hold a basket above your head for 2.7 seconds so let's go alright there we go Okay, so for this next skill, I oh, books shut I up, can. bitch. Alright, this next skill is called the Extreme Roast Skill. So what you gotta do is you gotta gather a crowd around someone, like this little yellow dude right here, alright? And then you gotta hit him with a roast. Boy, you look like a lonely turd. real nigga. <laughs> So, uh, thank you guys for watching. If you guys want to know any other Skyrim tips and tricks, just let me know down in the comments below, and I'll be sure to get to them. So, once again, thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you guys next time. Alright, this next skill is known as the Roast of Plant. Look like Patrick's head.